for better or worse. Philosophy is really just the study of learning to take yourself as learning to take the we, the world as seriously as possible, and, and then learning to take yourself more seriously than that. <laughs> for me, anyway, it became a giant ego trip, and it was something I had to get over. It took a while. <laughs> I spent all my time with old dead white guys, you know, in the form of, of, of pages of books. And if you spend all your time with white dudes, you get really hungry, you know. And in Winnipeg, you can press two seven times on your phone, and a pizza will magically show up at your house. It's, it's like the bat phone for college kids. <laughs> And I ordered this gigantic, extra-large, extra-cheese pizza, and I ate half of that thing, and I just got so sleepy, you know? And I fell asleep onto the other half of the pizza. Cheek pressed into that extra-cheesy crust. And I went into this deep, psychedelic cheese dream. If you need an extra jump in your step, or you need some kind of a trip away from your life. A half a block of cheese right before bed might be your ticket. <laughs> I fell asleep and, and then went into this psychotropic dream where all of my favorite historical figures showed up at my house at this big end of year cake party. And I woke up, and on the pizza box, was written the bare bones of this song. I wrote it in my sleep, and it's really the first song I wrote that I thought was any good and sounded anything close to John Prime, who I always wanted to sound like. I look back on it now. I think it's nowhere close to John Prime. It's pretty much the reason why I'm here. It's called the party song. wine with Dionysus. Judas is arguing with Apollo about what the meaning of life is. See, I sent out invitations to a party I was throwing and everybody came. And everyone except for Jesus forgot to RSVP. He's a good guy that Jesus wants to get to know. I never thought that Nietzsche would get along with Rousseau, but with a little bit of booze, the conversation just seemed to flow. Old Marx was in my backyard getting high on the trampoline, so it reminds him way too much of the liberal political economy. And I know that I'm hosting, but I cannot entertain. Cause I'm tired of taking life so seriously And staring up her skirt so long at her black underwear She used to take me for a sucker Now she's taking me upstairs It's just a metaphor <laughs> Oh, Bobby Dylan, he showed up from Northern Minnesota. He said, Dell, you sure are one skinny little bugger. <laughs> he heard Guthrie was back all the way from his grave just to play some songs for folks who were too damn drunk to leave. Yes, I know that I'm hosting, but I cannot entertain. Cause I'm tired of taking life so seriously. Staring up her skirt so long in her black underwear She used to take me for a sucker Now she's taking me upstairs You should have seen when Gandhi rolled right through my front door He was on one of them hipster fixed gear bikes 
with a smile that seems so sure. He was passing out drinks to anyone who was looking for. Pass right out on my bathroom floor. Yes, I know that I'm on skin, but I cannot entertain. Cause I'm tired of taking life so seriously. And staring up her skirt so long at her black thong underwear. She used to take me for a sucker, now she's taking me upstairs. She's taking me upstairs. I have to tell everybody this. First of all, it's life's skirt, you know, if you're feeling offended. And I don't mean to offend. I wrote it in my sleep. I don't blame you for what you dream about. <laughs> I guess I am up on stage doing it, so it sort of is my fault. <laughs> but I played this song one time in this place you've heard of called Fort McMurray, Alberta. <laughs> and I said, you know, folks, that's a metaphor. It's life skirt. <laughs> sure enough, there's a guy in the back of the room, all tattoos, leather and chains. He looks at me and over the top of the crowd, his voice soars, he says, Meta what? <laughs> it's one of the many reasons why it's so good to be in Regina. <laughs> so here's the moral of my party, if you care enough. Sometimes the truth, it gets a little gray, and life starts getting rough. You might even feel like reasons just playing hard to get. But life is full of things that don't quite end up making sense. You know, life is full of things that don't quite end up.